Hello guys, welcome to iMobi channel. Are you locked out of your Oppo device due to FRP lock or Google verification on Android 13? Don't worry, we've got you covered. In this video, we'll guide you through the process of bypassing FRP on your Oppo device running from Android 11 to Android 13. Before I make this video, I searched the Oppo FRP bypass on YouTube to find the fastest way for you guys, and I found this one. This method is coming from the high rank video under that keywords. Let's imitate the steps to see if it works. First, if you are on the hello screen, then tap next, you will see the language selecting the page, and you will see the emergency call button here, tap it. Input the strings asterisk hashtag 813 hashtag. And tap on the call after that. In the video I saw, at this step, the screen will automatically jump to the home screen, and the FRP lock will be bypassed. But mine didn't work. So I tried it twice to check if I did wrong. I am not sure if it only can be worked on a specific Oppo phone. So you guys can have a try and leave your comment to let us know. And no worries, we still have tip 2 that will definitely work on all Oppo phones. Let's check it. Actually, DroidKit has updated to support bypassing FRP lock. On Oppo's Xiaomi Redmi and Poco phones. Not only supports Samsung devices as previously. This means that the DroidKit FRP Bypass allows you to remove Google account verification on Samsung, Xiaomi, Redmi, Poco, or Oppo devices running Android 6 to Android 13. First, download the DroidKit on the website and launch it on your computer. Then select the FRP Bypass feature. Connect your device to your computer with a USB cable. And then click the Start button. Today, we're talking about Oppo FRP Bypass, so choose the Oppo brand. And the Droid Kit will automatically prepare the configuration file for your device. After the file is prepared, click the Start to Bypass button, and then please follow the instructions above. First, select the English language and connect to Wi-Fi, and insert a SIM card. If you continue to Next, you will see the FRP lock. So stay on the Wi-Fi page and tap the Wi-Fi info icon. Open the Wi-Fi QR code and tap on Nearby. Turn on the Nearby and click the Need Help Sharing button on your phone. Click the Share button. You will see a pop-up. Click the Message App icon. Tap to send a new message and send the YouTube URL to any contacts. Tap the link you can go to YouTube and tap the user button when you're on YouTube. Tap the settings button and click the about button. Go to Google privacy policy. It will turn on the browser. Enter the Droid Kit link in your browser. You will go to settings. Go to lock screen and lock screen layout. Find the clone phone icon and select the this is the new phone option. And then you just need to follow the clone phone instructions on the Droid Kit. After you finish the steps, your Oppo FRP lock is bypassing. Wait a minute. Later your Oppo device FRP will be bypassed. You can enjoy your device freely now. That's all for today's video thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get more tips, and leave your comment if you have any questions.